Okay, this next technique is called koshinage. Koshi, part of the technique, literally refers to the lower back portion. Um, nage, again, is throw. So I'm throwing my partner over my hips or my lower back. A good way to start this out, again, with a gyakuhami katate tori, wrist grab. I want to open up the space, move my feet directly in front of my partner. And I want to try and keep a fairly thin stance, and not to get too wide for this. Lift and extend the hand that he's grabbing in the direction I want my partner to go. If I want him to go over my hips, the hand should be extended over the hips, not over the shoulder. I don't want to pull him over my back. So open up the space, move right in front of my partner, extend the arm and look where I want my partner to go, and all the way over. Again, I don't want to feel like I'm having to get in here and lift my partner up. I'm simply giving my partner a pivot point for his hips to roll over. So I shouldn't feel like I'm doing too much lifting. Up, extend, and over. So koshinagi can happen as I extend the hand across my back. It can also happen as I push my partner's hand in front of their body, and I'll insert my hips here. Right. In front, I can also move. And then from various other attacks, shomenuchi. Koshinagi, hip throw.